I think this book is intended for anybody who is feeling a certain amount of despair at how ugly things are in the country right now and who wants to be a part of making change but doesn't know where to start. I think the good news is you don't have to do it by yourself and you're not the only one that feels this way. I think right now is a really scary time because we're watching people we love, sometimes family members, sometimes friends, sometimes people we don't know but who we know deserve dignity. We're watching them being harassed, we're watching them being arrested, we're watching them be hurt. And it can feel like because they're getting that direction from the highest reaches of our government that there's nothing we can do to stop that from taking hold of our country. My hope is that people read this book and the inspiring stories of people who resisted the ugliness, who resisted the hate, and actually created whole communities of hope, peace, and love by using some very technical skills and by using a lot of heart and by using a lot of humility. I'm hoping people will read this book and realize you can do the exact same thing.